Hey, what's going on, Capital Wastelanders? Razador here, with another episode of Capital Wasteland Legionary. We're starting to make our way into the double digits, the early teens, if you will, and we got a lot of stuff going on today. But before we start, just a quick rundown of what we'll be doing. Whether it's been a while or if you're new, in which case, welcome to the show, love to see ya. We have to beat the game, both Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas, courtesy of Tale of Two Wastelands, as a recruit legionary. And yeah, on screen now you can see the Recruit Legion armor and helmet. And over here where the mouse is wiggling, we have a full list of the weapons and apparel available to us. Now you'll see 10mm, stuff like that. 10mm in this challenge, the way that I do mine anyway, means that we can use any variant of a 10mm. So, the Weathered, the Silence, which is a Fallout 3 exclusive, the Police Pistol, which is a which is a 357 and a really good one too. You get that from the Dead Money DLC. But I just happened to find one in Arlington Library. That was pretty awesome. I kind of forgot this thing existed until I found it. And I was like, oh, snap, baby. That was awesome. And then the Mesmatron here. We're working for Paradise Falls. I remember of Kaisar's Legion. It's just, it just works perfectly, you know? So we can use the Mesmatron to do the repeatable, strictly profitable quest. We can use this so long as it's for the purposes of fulfilling our quest objective. Oh, and one more thing before we start is that because we are playing as a member of the Legion, we do a little bit of uh, in-character funsies here on this show. So just know that in addition to the stuff I just showed you, we're also going to be banning the use of chems and alcohol. Kaisar bans chems and alcohol for his Legionaries, so we're going to ban it too. However, we're going to have a bit of our own little caveat here. We are allowed to use Stimpaks, um, Radaway, Radex, and Doctor's Bags, and the one exception to Chems is Hydra, because Hydra is a Legion product. It's their equivalent of a Doctor's Bag. And I probably won't use it too much, though, since we have, we have Doctor's Bags, they're just better. But yeah, just figured to get all that out of the way. All that said and done, my friends, sit back and enjoy the show. Okay, so first things first, in between episodes, I was looking up where we could drop off this, um... Naughty Nightwear we found while we were exploring. We were doing the quest for Grey Ditch, those it was called. So, apparently... Oh, it's on our map already. Oh, yeah, that's right. I guess the, um... I guess the note we found told us where it is. I was gonna go mark it, but... <laughs> well, it's right on our map, so no problem there. So go ahead and go up to, uh, Smith Casey's Garage and make our way southwest, and... And we'll be good to go. Oh, I thought I equipped that. I thought I equipped our broad machete. I must have de-equipped it. Weeps. What's over here? What do we got? Rad Scorpion? Yeah, we should probably play it safe and go with... No, unless you... Oh, we're actually out of 9mm. What did, what did that happen? Oh, oh, well. Well, we do have... Actually, I think I'm going to go with our shotgun. We have the most ammo for that right now. Haven't used it too much. And I figure, hey, might as well get some usage of this bad boy in. Uh -oh. oh, there's a second one. Right, we should, we should be good here. Couple, nice, strong start. Love it. Huh? Oh, jeez, man, everyone's out to kill us today. Didn't see that mf -er there. Okay, um, forgot to sell- I gotta sell some of those chems, too. They're in our inventory. We can pick them up, but we're not allowed to use them. Uh, yoink. Let's go. Oh, man. Oh, perfect. Now, I don't mind us doing so little- such little damage, because there's a, um... There's a GRA challenge, you get a certain amount of critical hits on an enemy. And that's with guns, melee weapons, and the like. I think we're up to like 80-ish for the guns right now. Oh, jeez. Gotcha. Cool. Ah, uh, we're still in the... Oh, no, we're in the danger zone. Again. Another one, Gemini. Woo! So stunned. 
Ah, kiting. This should be a lot harder to pull off than Fallout 4 with the AI being a lot better than it is here. Aha! Beautiful. Okay. No longer being targeted. Now we can make our way down. We'll go to Girder Shade. Do our little turn in here. And then we're going to go to Robco Facility. I want, I did want to do that last episode. But we got caught up doing a, getting sidetracked with some other fun stuff. And Robco Facility, from what little I can remember, isn't the biggest dungeon. So we should be able to fit it in. Because I also want to make progress. Whoop. I want to make progress by getting through more main story. Ah, uh, they're just running away at this point. Ah, coward. I don't think animals could be cow- oh, I don't think animals could be cowards. <laughs> Very nice. Wow, and our, our shotgun's still in uh, decent condition, too. I mean, I, I know I haven't fired it that much. I say that because, again, in case you're new here, one of the traits we picked was built to destroy. For, for a th an additional 3% chance to crit with any weapon, we also have our weapons degrade 15% faster. I thought that was a good trade-off. Not only that, but I thought it would be some... What the heck? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> what the heck? Okay, um... Did that weapon mod... That... Huh, well... That's a little bit of a bummer. The weapon mod doesn't seem to be... War seems to be malfunctioning here. Oh... Never, ch never change, never change. Well... I guess then we'll just have to make do with our silenced one here. I kind of prefer it anyway, since it come, this one comes pre-modded. Any weapon like this in Fallout 3, like the silenced 10mm or the scoped magnum, they're basically pre-modded weapons. That um, saves me a little bit of money, a little bit of time. I guess we're going to be selling that um, weathered 10mm pistol, unless the mod is uh, an additional weapon mod fixes that. Boy, that's weird. Uh, whatever. Um, yeah, back to the broad machete. It, it's not in the best condition. It has certainly seen better days, but hey, once we get here to Girder Shade, maybe, just maybe, we can fast travel back to Rivet City. Yeah, probably Rivet City. And then get our and then get it repaired, and then we'll be good to go. Ah, Girder Shade. Very good. Very, very good. Okay, uh, Ronald Laren's house? Maybe. Hey, Ronald Laren, are, are you the guy who got that nasty, uh, that nasty sleepwear stuff. Well, nobody saw him right now, so I don't mind if I do. Okay. Can sell that steady. Real shame we can't use it. Arguably my favorite chem. I do like turbo a lot. But man, steady is just immensely useful. Okay. Gotta be here somewhere. Ah, maybe it's, uh, Sierra Petrovita's house. This is the Nuka Quantum chick, too. Yep, that's definitely her. Uh, yeah, we'll leave her alone for now. It's good to have this unlocked that way. Oh, God, the game's breaking. Oh, my God. Reality's warping. Where is... Huh. Where is that guy? Okay. I, I see a Brahmin. Maybe you can wait a couple hours. Because right, everyone's asleep anyway, so might as well. Well, I'll be damned. Hmm. I was hoping we could turn that in. But, if we can't, I guess we can just hold on to it. What's that? Army Robo Brain. Oh, that's gonna be fun. With his little psionic mind blasting. I'll miss wow. you. Well, the feeling's not mutual, I assure you. It's over here. I sense another enemy in the force. Ah. 
Um. There we go. Cool. Awesome. Yeah, very strange. Very strange. It is an unmarked quest, though, so... Whatever. Okay. Down here. Yeah, it's still just the Brahmin. Maybe to get that one guy to spawn, we have to talk to her. Maybe, maybe she does want the... The naughty nightwear. Hey, you! Sierra Petrova does the name. Good to see a new face in Girder Shade. I take it you're here to check out my new Coca-Cola collection and take the tour. Uh... <laughs> that's a good one. Sure, why not? Well, come on, then. Let me show you around. But no free new Coca-Cola until the end of the tour. Uh, okay. I get, it, I get it for free, that's cool. When Nuka Cola was invented by John Caleb Braverton in 2044, it quickly became the world's most popular soft drink. Okay. The Wonder Drink soon drew a dedicated following, which prompted the Nuka Cola Corporation to release many promotional items like these. Okay. By 2067, a Nuka Cola machine such as this rare, pristine model could be found on almost every street in America. What the what the hell's America? Even in today's crazy world, Nuka Cola is still the number one choice of refreshment among Armageddon survivors. As promised, here is a little pick me up, an ice cold Nuka Cola. Just look at the frost on the bottle. So cold and delicious. Pardon me. <clears throat> I tend to lose myself when I hold on to a Nuka Cola. Before I get to the little proposition I have for you, let me tell you a little bit about Nuka Cola Quantum. I didn't know you could get addicted to this stuff. That's weird. Um, sure. What? I think I have one of those. I don't know what that is, though. Well. Right before the bombs fell, the good folks at Nuka-Cola developed what they hoped was an improvement on the original formula. Calling it Nuka-Cola Quantum. It was said to have twice the calories, twice the carbohydrates, twice the caffeine, and twice the taste! Uh, that's, uh... Interesting, so... What went wrong, exactly? Well, the flavor certainly wasn't the issue. The public was just split on the unique feature of the Quantum's appearance. You see, to make it stand out on store shelves and to give it that extra kick, the formula called for a mild isotope. The effect was a drink that not only boosted your energy, but also glowed with a bright blue light. Wait, uh, that... Isn't that... So is there radiation in that thing? Oh, no. Only ever so mildly. So, yes. No ill effects were ever recorded. Well, it does have the unique property of making your... Um... Your... Pea glow. Uh-huh. So, why are... Why do you like this again? I love the stuff! I can't get enough of it! I thought I was hooked on regular Nuka-Cola, but the Quantum beats it by a long shot. I've got to have more! Okay, yeah. Um, <laughs> you're clearly addicted to this stuff. Maybe we should ban that too. So, uh, I guess this is where I come in? That's right. You bring me Nuka Cola Quantum, and I pay you. Handsomely, I might add. For every bottle you bring me, I pay you some caps. You know, for expenses. But if you're super cool, and find, like, enough bottles to fill my Nuka-Cola machine, 30 and all? I've got a super secret cool prize for you. Wait, okay, so... You wanna buy this junk off of me? This is sounding a lot like a chem dealer, but Nuka-Cola's not a chem, but you're acting weird, like you're... on chems. Whatever, fine. It's easy caps, sure. Oh, goody! I can taste the quantum already. Good luck to you, sweetie. 
Uh, do you know anyone named Grady? Nope. Sorry. Huh. Well, I guess she wasn't the one looking for it. I gotta go. Be careful out there, sweetie. Uh, strange lady. Hey, pal, what were you doing in Sierra's place? Uh, excuse me? What's it to you, pal? Because I'm making sure that no one messes with her. She's my girl, you know. Uh, she didn't say anything about that. Well, that's likely because it's none of anyone's business but ours. She's one hot lady, though, am I right? Uh, you know what? I don't have time for this. All right, suit yourself. I was going to make you an offer that could earn you some caps, but if you don't have the time to listen... Unless you want to hear what I have to say, we have nothing to discuss. All right, fine. What do you need? I know she's asked you to find her some Nuka-Cola Quantum. Heck, she asks everyone that wanders through here. What I'm proposing is you still look for the drinks, but instead of bringing it to her, you bring it to me. She'll be so impressed that I got all the Nuka-Cola for her, she'll melt in my arms like butter. I pay you the same she was going to pay, and everyone's happy. Huh, um... So you want me... To give this to you, and then you take credit for my work, which you're going to pay me. I don't care, you yeah, know, whatever. Thought you might. Good. I'll see you soon, then. Hey, hold on. I got something to ask you. Bringing me some quantum, I hope. You know someone named Grady? Grady? Maybe. Why are you asking? I have a package for you from him. Holy crap! You have it? Well, hand it over. I've been waiting over a year for that damn thing. <sighs> sure, here you go. Hey, thanks a bunch for bringing it to me. You could have been a jerk and sold it to someone else, but you didn't. Ah, uh, hell, let me give you the rest of the caps. I was going to give Grady anyway. Ah, huh, okay. Hmm, maybe I will do this guy's job for him. 200 caps? Uh, sounds good to me. All right, get out of here. Just remember, only one that's going to lay a finger on her is me. Got it? Why well, doesn't he just ask her? I get the I get the impression they're not together. Kind of a kind of a wimp, isn't he? Who the hell can't Who the hell can't tell a girl that he likes her? Uh, I don't understand these dissolute. All this need for dishonesty. Whatever. I'll be out of here soon anyway. I did want to check this place out before heading back to wherever the hell I was going. I can't find my I can't find any clues about getting out of here. Maybe maybe James knows something. I'm head back his way. Maybe he's made some progress on whatever the hell he was doing. Okay. There's a big mole rat. Damn. What's all this? Ah, crap I don't need. There's crap I need. Alright. Huh, a Protectron's been destroyed. What, did it get blown up by that mole rat? <laughs> ah, that's funny. Okay, nothing, nothing. Yoink. Okay, nothing here. Oh, never mind. Excuse me. Nothing here at all. Okay. Maybe here? Ah, not bad. Nope. Okay. Gotta be something interesting in this building. Yeah, because... Robco, that's... I remember... I remember Wolpes saying something about that guy, like, Mr. House owning that company or something. So if there's any way to get back to the Mojave Waste, and I could find a clue here. Of course. Should have done this sooner, actually. Okay, alright. Let's see. Uh, can't be impatient here. Waited this long? Get out. Ooh. 
Ah, oh, that scribe lady wants those books. I have quite a few of those to give her, actually. Strange that one would pay 100... Nice. Strange that one would pay 100 bottle caps for a book, but... Yeah, it's their money to spend and not mine. Okay, that's backed outside. I like to think that Rosaria just punted that thing instead of using his machete. Everything in here is so weak. Eh, can't say I mind that change of pace, though. Alright, Mark 1 turret. Uh-oh. Was I actually hitting that thing? Yeah, I was. Holy crap. Ah, jeez, guys. Wait your turn. I'll be, I'll be with you. Everything has a death wish here. Weird place. Alright. Saw some mole rats. Some big son of a bitch. Well, if there's one thing that's bigger here in the wasteland, it's stuff with the mole rats. Ah, excellent. More for me. Ah, I can practice my reading and learn more about science. And oh, look at that. Yes, so much goodness here. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. No, 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 no. Ooh, what's in here? Nope. We'll go ahead and use those books real quick. Um, big book of science check we use the uh, yeah we use the congressional style one too go ahead and use one of those might as well eat this while we're at it cool gotcha okay more roaches more rad roaches a pretty easy little area. Ah, all right. Can convert some of these. That's that science book is sure is helping me out. Footlocker. Hey, cool. Protectron. Also cool. Robco jumpsuit. Yeah, we take that. It'll make a fine addition to our collection. Hey, bottle cap mine. Sweet. I don't think so. <sighs> Nothing in here either. I thought I thought that house guy had a lot of money. What? Why is this place such a dump? Like everything else here. <sighs> All right. Like I told myself earlier, just gotta be a little patient. Been here long enough. I'm sure I'll find my answer. I haven't even found a working terminal here. Ah, uh, offices and cafeteria. I'm proud of myself for being able to read that. I don't think I would have been able to before I got here. Ah, uh, gotta work on my aim. Him. Oh, delicious. Someone must have been here recently. Well, <laughs> finders keepers. Alright, nothing there, nothing there. Open this bad boy up. Nothing there. Ah, ammo. Sweet, sweet. Also sweet. Alright. How about 
here. Heat blower. I don't know what you... Why would you want to blow on leaves? Such strange pre-war contraptions. Alright, we got quite a few energy cells, actually. I cannot believe there's not a single thing in here. Oh. I suppose I can't complain too much, however. More supplies is always a good thing. not expect to see one of those here. I don't see a terminal to activate activate the protectrons. Very strange. <sighs> Alright. Looks like this place was a bust. Though I won't deny the extra supplies are handy. There's a lot of vermin in here to slay too. My machete has definitely seen better days. Ha! <laughs> ha! <laughs> okay. Wow, yeah, our machete is on its way out the door. Okay. Uh, I don't think our poor legionary is going to be finding any clues here. Hear that filthy little creature. Must be on the other side. Okay. Uh, of course not. Uh, pre war books, maybe? No, no. Not a thing. I found a couple here. We gotta go back to. Uh, Scribe Yearling, I think was her name. Yeah, she'd like these. Make some money off of it. Nothing there. Railway spikes. Ooh, excellent. I think what I'll do, actually, is I'll sell the uh, Nikola Tesla on you because we don't need an energy weapon score. Although, I do wonder if it would increase the effectiveness of our Protectron, as that is technically an energy weapon. Okay, nothing here. Nothing in here, either. Ah, finally something to kill. Darts. Oh, there's, there was one more room we can explore here that led a little further up, I believe. So we'll head upstairs and you know, see where that leads us. I, I remember this being a place we have to go for, for Moira, but obviously that's just not happening. Oh, cool. Oh, I thought I killed the I thought I killed the roach in there. I, mean, I guess that roach I just swung on by. I thought he'd hang out. It didn't turn out so well for him. Okay. Doesn't look like we've checked in here yet, or did we? No, we didn't. Excellent. Okay, nothing there. That, that, that. Excellent. So far, so good. May not have found any clues on how to get back to the Mojave Wasteland, but by golly, we are finding some good stuff in here. Oh, okay. Hold on, 
let me uh pop up our local map here. Yeah, that upstairs. There we go. I'm, I don't think there's any other additional like floors for us to zone into, but this should be the last of the area of the Robco facility. Okay, get in there. Yo. Nice. Plus five Orple says what? Okay, nothing then. Ah. I don't really feel like using the um the magazine on that. I gotta start I gotta start checking vendors for more of those magazines too. Okay. Yeah, it looks like the um I'm sure the I'm sure the enemy we have to kill is locked behind that door. Or 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 What's this? Oh. Yeah, that's the um that's what you need for a Moyer. I might I'm yeah, you know what I was thinking about uh opening like unlocking that, but yeah, screw it. It is XP. But I'm going to go against my own advice here and just forsake that little bit of XP. Already at the 31 minute mark, so I'd like to get a bit of a move on here. Ha! <laughs> Perfect! Our last machete swing. And it kills the last enemy that we have to face in here. Cool. Alright. Time to beg it to bounce uh, booty on out of here. Shouldn't be too much farther away. Yep, perfect. What's in here? Ah, that was already in there. Never mind. Let us go. And then once we're out of here, we'll be back in the wasteland. Definitely gotta get some repairs done. Excuse me. Uh oh, appears we are not finished yet. Darn. All right, it's fine too. Ah, I'm all right. <laughs> Excellent. Last area we didn't check. And it's nothing. Alright, let's go, go, go. So, feist things feist. Rivet City. I don't think we'll make it in time for the shop, unfortunately. Yeah, no way. Unless they close at 9 o'clock and we can just get there. We'll find out. I'm betting no, but hey. Oh, well, I'm, I'm, it's a good thing I'm not a betting man. The Meyer lurks have been quiet lately. Yeah. What up, Shret? We're going to close soon. You better get out of here. Well, you better repair my stuff first. Let's have a look at it. Cool, all right. Repair that, repair that, repair that, that. My varmint rifle. Or this jumpsuit thing I found. My police pistol. All right, buddy. I'm about to get some stuff your way. So I hope you got some caps. What you looking for? Rid of that, 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 those. Ah, uh, nope. That's for uh, casting. I'll keep this for the time being. Um, that's where we gotta sell the jet. Um, we can keep that. Medex, two psychos, some steady. Oh, it hurts me to do that. Every time, man, just every time. Some poison glands we can sell. Each way a pound, too. 
Ugh, seven of those. Don't even want to know where those have been. 44 Magnum, 45 Auto. These. That, that, that. Oh, boy. Ooh. Adati Raz is loving that. Okay. Cool. All right. One last, one last glance. Anything? Ah, uh, nope. Thanks. Yeah, uh, get out of here. Come back soon. We always got a lot of ammo in stock. Actually, wait. I gotta check in if for something real quick. It. Um. Yeah. The um. Any books he might have on him? Pre-war book. Nope. Okay. Figured I'd check. What about aid? Eh, I got plenty of healing right now. Screw it. Okay. We'll talk to this guy. This place. The market is closing soon. You better make it quick. Ah, no smartass attitude. I like it. Now I gotta buy something. Straight to the point. I like that. Um, okay. He doesn't have any miscellaneous. Forgot about that. Eh, get on with yourself. Come back soon. This is closing soon. Do your business closing and get time. out. Oh, man, no need for that. Gary Staley. There we go. Take a look around. I got all kinds of stuff in here. Oh, not a little bit of everything this time, huh? Well, let's see. I've got a little bit of everything. Uh, I shouldn't have said anything. Okay. Pre-war money, no pre-war book, though. Maybe he'll get one back in stock. Oh my god, two wood chippers. What the hell do you need two for? You only need one for that, um, that item you can make, right? Yeah, I'll buy 37 bullets. Never hurts to have more of those. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Alright, uh, close up shop. See you later. Hey. I'm not in the mood to talk, lady. Ah, blasted stairs. Okay. Well, I might as well check on James and see what he's up to. Clown. Oh, they've actually kept the super mutants away. I'm surprised. Huh. Oh. Hi. Let's see what's going on in here. Alright, James. My god, have you guys done any work here since I've been away? You people are idiots. Here we are, where it all began. You remember your mother's favorite passage? No. Revelation 21.6. I am Alpha and Omega. What the hell are you talking the about? And the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. Uh... Don't you see? No. This is what it all means. What does it mean? The water, the purifier. This is the water of life. Your mother's dream. No point in wasting time. Let's get to work. There's much to be done. Um, did you know my tribe? Well, what are we... All right, what are we doing? I, I don't care. What are we doing? The project was abandoned shortly after you were born. Things have deteriorated here since then. And there's been some flooding. Yeah, no shit. I need you to get to the flood control pumps and activate them so we can clear out the water and reach the mainframe. Okay. Where do I need to go then, James? The automatic doors sealed when the flooding occurred. So you'll have to use the access tunnels to reach the pumps. Some people are in such a hurry. <laughs> well, maybe you guys should get your rack together. God, I've gone through like, what, like a... A quarter of the wasteland, and you guys haven't done shit since I've been here? Or honest to God, do these people have any initiative? Okay, okay. I suppose one last errand wouldn't hurt. I gotta ask James about the Mojave Wasteland. I think that guy's going crazy. Like, he's talking about his mother or something? Hell if I know. Red mark on the pumps. Hurry back, and I'll give you the fuses you need. Okay. Well, he must have good hearing if he heard that all the way down here. 
<sighs> okay, okay. Just be patient, Rosarius. We're so close. I, I can f I can feel it in my bones. How's it going? Oh, hi. At least someone's friendly around here. Ha 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 ha. Idiot. Maybe they plan on eating that mutant. There's a lot of meat to go around. I wouldn't blame them. Hey, you. I think we need to talk. Why? I've been hearing things. Things that have happened out there. Okay. Megaton destroyed? You? You didn't have anything to do with that, did you? Uh, well, Kaiser ordered me to do it, so I think. So, what do you care? What you do in the world may be your business, but here, with me, you are my son. Uh-huh. I can't begin to tell you how disappointed I am. Cool. That goes against everything I ever taught you. You didn't teach me anything. I want to talk more about this later. For now, let's just focus on our work. Man, this guy really wants me to be his son for some reason, doesn't he? Weirdo. So he's not he's not even that mad that I blew up Megaton, he's just a little disappointed. <laughs> wow, uh, okay. So just give me the fuses, you idiot. Right. The flooding shorted out some of the fuse boxes downstairs, including one that controls some of the automatic doors. Here, take these fuses. The box is back down in the sub basement near the eastern end of the level. Once the fuses are replaced, you'll be able to get to the mainframe. Okay. Be careful, my son. Ugh. Gross. Yeah, I think that poor guy's finally lost his mind. What? Yeah, that's what I. That's what I'm saying. This guy's weird, man. Like, there's got to be a condition for that. Like, how do you how do you get so crazy that you think a stranger is your son? I, I think. I think Wolf has called that projecting. Yeah, ah. Uh. Oh, the sooner I get away from that James guy, the better I'll be. Seriously, if he just if he just dropped dead or something, that would be kind of amazing. If the fuse is in place, you should be able to access the mainframe. No need to come back to the control room. Uh, uh, ew, 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 god, dirty water. Ugh. Okay, going up here. Eh, at least it's easy. Nothing, go nothing could possibly go wrong from something this easy, right? Okay. Ready for action. Now we've done it. It'll just be a few minutes until we can access the mainframe. Use the intercom so I can tell you where to go next. Okay. Excuse me. There are a few minor repairs still to be made up here in the control room. Why don't you come back here and give me a hand? I don't think so. Actually, wait. Yeah. There's one other thing I need you to do. God Janice damn it. says there's a blockage in one of the intake pipes. It's on your way back. Head back up to the museum level and give me a call on the intercom when you get there. Okay. Good luck, son. Well, may maybe his son died or something. I don't know. But still kind of weird that he's calling me his son. Maybe that's a capital wasteland tradition or something. I don't know. Just makes me more confident than ever that we need to bring Kaisar's Law here. Kind of doing a little bit that myself, actually. Got some. I got some minions over at Big Town. That's gonna be the uh, the capital of this capital wasteland, the Legion capital. Although maybe maybe Ten Penny Tower. I don't know, but it's just a tower. The Big Town's a town. We can use that for. Camp and supplies and all that good stuff. They got some legionaries who can, um, they should do a little bit of training. They're legion, they just don't know it yet. Huh? All right, everyone. You should be able to hear me now. We've restored power to the mainframe, which is coming online now. There's a lot of deterioration in the pipes and some damage to the substructure. But it's nothing we can't fix. Once the mainframe is online, we'll be able to access the database and hopefully learn where we can find a Gek. I'd like to thank you all for returning to this project after so many years. 
I know some of you thought, like me, this day would never come. We have a singular opportunity here. Uh -huh. A chance to make the wasteland a better place for I don't think you would make anything better. If anything, you've made everything here worse, you fool. Ah, good. Things are getting boring around here. That looks like those Brotherhood guys, but James called them the Enclave. I don't know. Hey, maybe I can send one to Paradise Fall. Yeah, they are on the list. I remember now. Ha 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 ha. Oh, I'm gonna get one of you punks. <laughs> hey, uh, Enclave guy, this might be a weird time, but do you know a guy named James Pinkerton? <laughs> oh, man, what's wrong with these guys? They just... I don't remember... If... I know, I know it's it malfunctions, but my goodness. <laughs> That's kind of awesome. <laughs> oh, this, this, is, this is a thing of beauty. There's got to be some more Enclave guys here. Hey, hey buddy. Who are you again? All right, well, you don't, I guess you don't know who this Pinkerton guy is. Maybe, But if you got some notes on him, I'm going to need to take it off of you. A thief? Oh, yeah. That. Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit out of it. Maybe you better hold on to this stuff, you know, to keep it safe or whatever. Yeah, exactly. That's my thoughts exactly, honey. Don't worry, it'll all be safe. Huh. Such a frail lady wearing massive power armor. She... Oh, I hate to send her away, but here, I put this on, honey. Okay. Hey, th this thing feels weird. Can I take it off now? You can take it off when you get to Paradise Falls, but do it before that and it's gonna explode. Oh, that sounds painful. Okay, which way is Paradise Falls again? Uh, yeah, I really wish that guy would give me more than one of those to work with. It's kind of frustrating. Yeah, we definitely gotta keep that stuff repaired. No way in Heffel are we gonna be carrying that. Ah, oh. Hey, James, uh, thanks for bringing me here, actually. I, what the this fuck? This facility is now in. under James United States door. government control. Why would he lock me out? The person in charge doing? is to step forward immediately and turn over all materials related to this project. That's quite impossible. This is a private project. The Enclave has no authority here. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Ah, uh, shoot, shoot him, guy. I to assume, sir, that you are in charge? Shoot him. Yes, I'm responsible for this project. Then I repeat, sir, that you are hereby instructed to immediately hand over all materials related to the purifier. I'm sorry, but that's... Yeah, you tell him. Furthermore, you are to assist Enclave scientists in assuming hey, control um, of the administration and operation Do you know who James Pinkerton is? I kind of need once. to know that. Colonel. Is it, Colonel? Uh, maybe can't I'm hear sorry, me. but the facility is not operational. It never has been. Can't wait to see how James messes this up. Your time here. Sir, this is the last time I am going to repeat myself. Stand down at once and turn over control of this facility. Colonel, I assure you that this facility will not function. We have never been able to successfully replicate test results. I suggest you comply immediately, <laughs> sir. In oh, order yeah, to I like the way this guy does incidents. business. Are we clear? Yes, Colonel. Colonel, oh boy. Do whatever you want. There's no need for more violence. Then you will immediately Shoot hand him, over Colonel. all materials related to this project. Can't she just give it to you? And making it operational at Damn once. it. Very well. Give me a few moments to bring the system online. Ha <laughs> ha, you coward. I... You can't do this. I knew it. Addison, please. Now is not the time. I'll get the information the Colonel needs, but I need you to... I won't help you do this, James, not after everything it took to get here. I need you to monitor the output levels on pumps three and four. What the hell? Please, step over to the panel and keep an eye on them, will you? What? What are you talking about? That doesn't even make sense. Madison, please. It's very important that you do this right now. Just James, I think the Colonel the can hear you, you moron. The control booth. James, I... Please, just monitor the pumps. 
Uh, Colonel, I, th I think this is a trap. I grow tired of waiting. You're very patient. You're nearly finished. <laughs> oh, what, what the hell? Run. Ha! Uh, Run! <laughs> Was I supposed to feel bad for that guy? Idiot. Oh, honey, let's go. Whoa, you got a gun. James. He's gone. Thank God. We have to get out of here. They'll be coming for us next. We've got to evacuate now. Oh, whatever. Let's, let's just go. I don't care. There's an old tunnel that will lead us out of here to someplace safe. We used it as an evacuation route once before, but that was a long time ago. Okay. I hope everyone remembers how to get there. There isn't time to round everyone up. Come on, follow me, and hurry! Alright. <gasps> hurry up. Ah, uh, shame about that Colonel guy. I, I like the way he does things. Very smart. Okay. We need to escape while we can. Um, yeah, sure. <laughs> you guys can. Actually, you know what? Yeah, we'll go together. I like my I like my meat shields at bullet blocking distance. Don't wander off. We're going to need you. Did you just hear what I just said? Now hurry up and go in front of me. This tunnel leads to the Citadel, the Brotherhood of Steel's fortress. We should be safe there if we can make it. Wait, Caston's place? Oh, well, let's, let's go. Um you have a plan? We need to keep everyone together, and we need to get through this tunnel as quickly as possible. We're not safe until we reach the other side. You should stay close, and we'll follow behind you. Okay. Let's go. We'll be right behind you. Be careful. <laughs> you mean in front of me? Hold on, which one of these punks looks like they can fight? How about this guy? I better not ever find out that you or your father had something to do with it. He's not my dad. If I even think you sold us out. What the hell are you talking about? Uh, that James guy's dead anyway. Oh, hell. I'm sorry. I didn't know. I just thought that since this happened after you showed up, well, you know, man, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't be. I'm not. Well, you wanna, you wanna make yourself useful here, boy? I can try. I'm not much good with weapons, but if you've got a pistol I can use, I'll do what I can. Ah. <sighs> Sorry, don't. Uh, that's mine. Okay. If you find one, let me know. Shame I can't give him the 9mm. Alright, meat shields, let's go. I don't care if any of you survive. Oh, an enclave bot. Boom! Ha ha ha. Uh, they light up when you shoot them. That's awesome. Oh. Oh. That's amazing. Yeah, I, def I definitely like that. Hey, we found we finally found a, a campfire thing. Sweet. Oh, I like that. That's awesome. Yeah, run, you coward. You're lucky I don't have more collars. Bitch. Shoot him with guns. More of a machete guy myself, but I, I don't mind. Definitely don't mind. It, it'll take some time. Well, move your ass. What are you doing? Well, that was easy. What are you crouching there for? I mean, it's gonna hit you. You know that, right? Huh. Maybe I can understand what she's doing. Oh, no, no, that's too much for me. Huh. Now those Enclave guys are sure taking their time. I guess they got scared. Smartest decision they've ever made. Ooh, door open. Awesome. We, out of character, will go ahead and drop a save. Excuse me. I hope it gets a little more exciting in here. This is kind of boring. Those Enclave guys are wimps. Ah, oh, look at that. Ah, I must, I must have Mars's favor today. <laughs> Ow, man.
man. Don't you kick that at me again. I will kill you. I'm unarmed. Oh, shoot. I don't think so. This is hopeless. I'm unarmed. Shoot. Help. Where is? This is hopeless. I'm unarmed. Don't shoot. I don't think the ghouls can fire. I'm out of here. Come here, you. I'm. I know. Don't shoot. This is hopeless. Why are you pleading with ghouls anyway? That sounds like the ferals can't even understand what you're saying. You guys are supposed to be smart. <laughs> uh, you guys hang out with James. I shouldn't be surprised. Well, not anymore. <laughs> Am I right? Oh, that's great. That is most wonderful. Doctor Lee. Huh? We can't go any further. We need to stop. Um, okay, why? Garza has a heart condition. He needs medicine or he may not make it. I'm not moving until he gets the medicine he needs. Well, what medicine? I don't have sufficient medical supplies with me or else this wouldn't be a problem. If you have any stim packs, I would ask that you hand them over. Oh, man, I'm drowning in these things. Yeah, take them. I don't give a shit. Yes, this looks to be enough. He'll need medical attention once we've reached the Citadel, but this will get him there. Okay. Thank you. Give me a moment, and we can continue. Ah, okay. Whatever. Garza, here. This will help you to feel Ugh. better. Maybe I should've once just killed him. Citadel, you'll be fine. Ah, losing. I feel like I'm losing my edge. I'm feeling better. Let us continue, and not waste Okay, let's see what we got here. If you're up to it, we'll continue. Okay. More of that punga free. That's pretty good stuff, actually. I heard it was an acquired taste, but apparently not. Go ahead and save there. Alright. Maybe, uh, hmm, I don't have a collar, though. That's unfortunate. What if... Turning fire. Oh, guys, your, your, your armor's all dirty. Ooh, boy, ouch. That hurt. Um... Oh, I got so many stem packs. Well, you guys aren't—you guys aren't even good at the whole killing innocent civilians thing. Well, not—not not that there's any innocence where we come from, you know. Just throwing that out there. You guys kind of suck. That looks like they gotta move on. Uh oh. Oh boy. Ah, I'll be back for my revenge, you fools. Ah, so be it. Cowards with cowards up top can't come down and fight me like a man. Alright. Alright. I'm not thrilled about having to retreat like that. Ah, and someone to take it out on. Perfect. Ah, I should have uh, used the other one. Oh, that's the, that's pretty good. Okay, where where are the any more enclave guys out. coming up? Nope. I'm Ah, just a ghoul. <laughs> Hardly worth my time. <laughs> Off with your head, boy. Ah, Luca Cola Quantum, that girl wants that. Where are you going? 
fool. What's in here? Huh, I can't open that door, never mind. Did we lose one? Hmm. Seems that we did. I do actually. Well, we are down one man, but in this sort of situation, some sacrifices must be made. Ah. Ah, we are almost there. Perfect. I'll take that garbage to sell. Don't know why. I still don't understand why people like that stuff. It's freaking disgusting. I believe I can handle things from here. Wow, look at that. We're just over the hour mark, guys. Yeah, we did man, we did lose one. Ah, the boy the boy with the stim packs. At least those didn't go to waste. Like I thought they would. I am Dr. Madison Lee. I have people with me in need of shelter. You must allow us access at once. I'm sorry, ma'am. No unauthorized civilians allowed inside the citadel. You'll have to leave now. Lions! I know you're in there! I know you can hear me! You open this goddamn door right now! I like how she said she was unarmed, but she has an AR on her back. That's pretty funny. Uh, that wasn't so bad. Well, cool. This must be that lion. Ah, oh, yeah, she said lions, so these are Kasten's enemies. They don't know that I'm working with Kasten, so maybe, just maybe, hmm, yes. Very interesting. Ah, that is the Brotherhood's banner. But why are, why are, why haven't the other Brotherhood guys come here yet? We have to be close. Oh, this is a good sign, this is a good thing. I like it. Ah, it makes me feel pretty good right now. And speaking of feeling good, we are finished with another part of the main story of Fallout 3. Got some Rob code done and managed to get the turn in for Girder Shade as well. I made a lot of progress today. So we're about at the halfway point right now. And going forward, we're going to be dealing with some Enclave goons at some just random locations. That should be okay, though. I don't think there are any near um, Vault, uh, Vault 108 or Vault 92. I know there's some that are that are kind of close to 101, which is fine, really. But yeah, that should be something fun to look forward to in the future. Now, before we end off for the day, since our quest is complete, don't gotta worry about them anymore. We go to Fort Independence, and we have quite a bit of stuff to give our pal Kasten. Huh? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I didn't expect that. Ah, Kasten, I see that you still haven't cleaned your armor, I think. Well, look who it is. What have you got for us today? Well, gee, I thought those guys went inside, but apparently not. That's pretty funny. Oh, well. Back in character. All right, Kasten, I got quite a bit of stuff for you, my friend. Let's see what you've got. Well, to start you off with the little stuff. We can always use another one of these. How'd you like your payment? Ah, oh, right away's fine. Can't stand this stuff myself. Goes through me like a rampaging Brahmin. Ha! <laughs> uh, laser rifle. We can always use another one of these. How'd you like your payment? I think you know the drill by now, right away, just in case. Can't stand this stuff myself. Goes through me like a rampaging Brahmin. Got, uh... I got some power armor from those Enclave guys. Well, I'll be damned. The Advanced Power Armor Mark II. This is superb. Absolutely superb. Now, what can I give you in return? Ah, now we're talking. Uh, stem packs. There. Everyone's favorite. What would we do without them? Ooh, baby! 13 stem packs. Oh, man. Here's a power armor helmet from the Enclave. 
this is some pretty heavy-duty stuff. We'll take good care of it. Now, what can I give you in return? Radaway's calling my name, friend. Useful stuff out there. Hope you don't have to use too much. Another laser rifle. We can always use another one of these. How'd you like your payment? Right away. Can't stand this stuff myself. Goes through me like a rampaging Brahmin. Plasma pistol. Pretty rare piece of equipment, this. Good find. How'd you like your payment? Ah, stim packs sound good. Here, enjoy them in good health. Or at least, when you'd like to be in good health. And I've got a plasma rifle for you. Pretty rare piece of equipment, this. Good find. How'd you like your payment? Yeah, we'll go with right away. Useful stuff out there. Hope you don't have to use too much. Oh, that's all. Okay, then. Yep, I'll see you around. Good hunting out there. Ah, he, he was quite pleasant about that, actually. Alright, time to go to Paradise Falls really quick. This is gonna be pretty funny with Mattis and Leento. <laughs> oh, man. I wish we could give the others to these guys. Hey, Grouse. You idiot. Your slave's dead. What? You ruined perfectly good merchandise. I monitor the collars, you know. You need to be more careful. Do you want another collar and try again? You'll have to buy it. I'm not going to subsidize your screw-ups. Sure. There you go. Try to be more careful next time. <laughs> That's so funny. All right. Well, I'll uh, try again. Sure thing. Huh. Well, I guess the Enclave Soldier died. That's a shame. Okay, so back to the Citadel. And we'll stop here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. And I will catch you at the next episode. Take care now.